Hello Battlefilm fans, as you guys have known for years we've made these great pack system bags. Now over those years we've done a lot of different custom foam trays and some of those that you guys will probably recognize is something like the Space Marine Troop Tray. Now the cool thing about those trays as you can see these are our 15 and a half by 12 size foam trays and what these trays fit like for years and still do now is in some of our bags like the 432 they fit stacked like this which means your models would stand up and fit you know across the back of the bag. Now what we ended up doing for people that wanted to have their models sit uh, horizontally is we ended up going with the 720. Now the 720, the cool thing about that bag is, of course, you can stack all of your trays this way up and you can lay all your models flat. Now some customers don't mind if it's vertical or horizontal, it really doesn't matter. But what we wanted to do even further after customers had emailed us is go ahead and create even more customization for both of these two bags. And how do we do that? Well, what we ended up doing is, for instance, for the 720, we have what we call now the Battle Foam Small Trays. So that's a new name. So when you look on our website, you're looking for trays called the Small Trays. Now, as you can see, there's nothing really small about them when you look at what you can fit in the trays. Because like this tray where you're, it's designed for space marines, you got a drop pot in there, you got a walker of some sort, whatever that may be, and then you have some sort of rhino or similar armored vehicle. So what's cool about that is when you open up the bag, as you guys know, these bags open down and around allowing you to put your your trays before you would put them in like so. So they would just slide in there. But what we're gonna do now with this new size, again, the small size, is we would just stack them in like this, side by side. Now if you look, there's a variety of these that are already on the website, like take a look at this cool one here. This one is another Space Marine one, but this fits the new 32 mil bases that just came out for Space Marines. Uh, it also has space, uh, space for Terminators and space for rhinos. So what's cool about that is this tray now can fit just like that. So you can actually have all this side designed just for troops. Maybe you get yourself a more universal troop tray like this and just stack up one side all troops and then the other side all vehicles. It really gives you a little more to do as far as your customization ability. Of course, these type of trays you can find on a custom tray creator and really put whatever you want on them and then order them and get them put in your bags however you need. So even if you have trays for your armies but wanted to kind of split things up a bit, now you're able to do it, again, with the Battle Foam small trays. The other really cool thing about it is you can then still use your normal trays because, of course, if these are balanced out, you can just put it right on top. Or you can do it the other way around where you drop this guy on top and then put all of your other trays however you may want to do maybe your vehicles this way and then kind of trick out the back however you like. So that's really cool. Again, check out these under the pack system foam area and look for small trays. That is now going to be the new name for this. Same thing in the custom tray creator. If you're going to design trays this size, go to the small tray size. No more trying to figure out what everything is. Battle foam now has small, medium, and large. And that's going to be what we're going to show you here. So you have your small, you have your medium, and then you have your standard ones you guys are used to, large. So now let's take you over to the next set of trays. I'm gonna throw these guys on the, on the ground here, get this bag out of our way. And what you're gonna find is that now you have the 432. So everybody knows this bag, another very popular bag in our line. The one thing about folks with this bag, as we mentioned at the beginning of the video, was some guys don't like to have their trays stacked up vertically like so. For whatever reason, some players would rather prefer that their models always lay this way. So there's an easy answer for that. With the medium trays, like this bike tray here, the trays now lay completely flat inside of 432, similar to what the Privateer Press bag is like, similar to the Outlaw Miniatures bag. Those bags have trays that lay this way, horizontally. So what that allows you to do is it allows you to do something like this Terminator and Troop tray, and just build up your 432, some tanks here, some walkers here, and build up your tray like so. So now the 432 you probably already have can take advantage of these medium sized trays and be put inside your 432 in this stacked version. These are also in the custom tray creator. So if you're looking to make your own tray, all the shapes you're used to that you've had on there before, this is great for Star Wars. With all the Star Wars stuff coming out on a regular basis, what a great way to create your own tray in this size. Throw in your 432, you got yourself a brand new bag. You're never going to run out of options to be able to make sure your models fit correctly. So now, when you cinch this up, 
what you end up having is you have this smaller, airport-friendly, travel-friendly way to carry a ton of models. And as we've always said, the number on the front represents how many models you can carry in there. So 432 28 millimeter size models. With this design, you can actually fit more than that. So what was thought of before as a maximum amount of models being 432, you can fit even more if you just get troop trays for this. So this is a great way to store your stuff. And don't forget, all of our bags now have the Moly system. Moly system, if you look, some of the accessories, you can have tape measure accessories. These just cinch on the back here with these really sturdy straps and they're so good, it's hard to take them apart. And these guys slide back here. You can put your tape measure in here. You got an all round pouch. You got a media pouch. You got all kinds of crazy stuff. And we're always releasing these great accessories. So look for these on the accessories areas of the website. Look under Moly, look under the pack system, and you'll find everything you need. Check this stuff out. It's great, and there's a lot of choices. Thanks for watching.